An Israeli missile strike on a building in Syria's capital Damascus on Saturday killed four members of Iran's Revolutionary Guards, as reported by a security source within the regional pro-Syria alliance. The security source, part of a network of groups close to Syria's government and its major ally Iran, told Reuters that the multi-story building was used by Iranian advisers supporting President Bashar al-Assad's government and that it was entirely flattened by precision-targeted Israeli missiles. The Syrian Observatory for Human Rights and Opposition War Monitor claimed that at least five people were killed in the missile strike. The attack occurred during a meeting of officials from Iran-backed groups. According to state TV media reports, Western Damascus's Mazay neighborhood, where the residential building is located, is home to various diplomatic missions, including the embassies of Lebanon and Iran. An official associated with an Iran-backed group in the Middle East confirmed that the building was utilized by Revolutionary Guard officials. The official added that the Israeli missile completely destroyed the structure, resulting in 10 casualties. The strike follows a similar incident last month when an Israeli airstrike in a Damascus suburb resulted in the death of Iranian General Sayed Razi Mozavi, a prominent advisor to the Iranian paramilitary revolutionary guard in Syria. Over the years, Israel has targeted operatives from Palestine and Lebanon in Syria. The strike came amid widening tensions in the region as Israel pushed ahead with its offensive in Gaza. Israel's assault there, one of the deadliest and most destructive military campaigns in recent history, has killed nearly 25,000 Palestinians, according to Gaza Health Authorities, caused widespread destruction and uprooted over 80% of the territory's 2.3 million people from their homes. Israel launched the offensive after an unprecedented cross-border attack into Israel by Hamas on October. 7 that killed 1,200 people and took some 250 other hostages. Roughly 130 hostages are believed by Israel to remain in Hamas captivity. The war had stalked tensions across the region, threatening to ignite other conflicts. Israel has carried out hundreds of strikes on targets inside government-controlled parts of war-torn Syria in recent years. Israel rarely acknowledges its actions in Syria, but it has said that it targets bases of Iran-allied militant groups, such as Lebanon's Hezbollah, which had sent thousands of fighters to support Syrian President Bashar Assad's forces. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.